Hi, this is Pi Girl. In this video, we are going to start with a new video series on how to make a walkie-talkie. So the first video we will cover up with the mic testing and connections. So the components which we need for this video are ESP32 and INMP441. Links for these components are given below in description. Please take a look. INMP441 is omnidirectional MIMS microphone. This basically has six pins. One is serial data clock, serial data output, WS, LOR, and VCC, and also a ground pin. Now let's take a look at the connection. Here I'm giving a supply of 3.3 volts and also connecting ground to ground, WS to the 15th pin, LR to the ground and also connecting SCK to the 14th pin of ESP32 SD to the 32nd pin. So once all connections are done, connect it to your laptop. Now let's see the coding part of it. So first go to Chrome and look for your new window. Search for Arduino.cc. So once you get displayed with a web page, then go to the softwares. So just click on softwares and you will see this page and you can install it for the desired operating system and just click on windows and do just download okay then you'll start downloading it so once it is downloaded install it so once it is installed just open it so when you open it you see the options here so you need to click on arduino and here you can see your preferences click on preferences and here you can see additional board manager okay so i'll provide you a link in the description you need to put up that link over here and then uh, do okay for it so i'll just clear this off and put it so once it is done we will just go to tools and then look on to the board and board manager so here we will type for the looking board so here i will write esp32 so once you find it just click on the latest version and install it so i have already installed i've just closed it now we will just go to board and check this out in case if you don't find this board just try to reopen the arduino uh, again and then check it so as i have seen i have got my boards we will select the right board so here i'm going to select esp32 dev module let's code it now the official online document has all information regarding this so here you can also read about i2s i'll provide the link in the description so first here we need to install the drivers and set the communication pins the communication pins are ws sd and sck i2s install function is not a status function so that it cannot use the keyword in the function remove it now let's try to build it. Also connect L or R pin to the ground. In it I2S pop sample, it returns the number of bytes successfully read from DMA buffer will be either 0 or the size of configured bu sample buffers. Now we will set the tools before uploading the code, the CPU frequency, flash frequency and the port connected. In case if you are not able to connect the port, I will provide you a link in the description of my previous videos where you can resolve your port problems. Okay, so now we have uploaded the code and here what you need to do is instead of clicking on serial monitor, you need to click on serial plotter. So this is how the waveform is produced. In case if you want to specify with the appropriate waveform what you need to do is just whistle and this is your waveform it should be produced so this is the first video of our walkie talkie series so that's all for today in case if you like this video please take a moment and subscribe to my channel and also here are the instagram quiz winners